500 metres. Gates open now, there are Fanda racing to a perfect dispatch. Elusive Box is one of the first away. There's Beauty Ace going forward. Final over is up handy with the leaders as well. Then followed over on the inside next now by Basu Basu. One and a half to Hysteria Lane out wide is Joe Kuve from Karina Bell. Uh, then came Cantalara back over on the inside of Sombrui. And three lengths away, Spawn of Elia is last. 700 metres to go. And Elusive Box has retained the lead by one length from Beauty Ace. A length away trailing third on the inside is Basu Basu followed by final over in a nice spot uh, then working forward Joe Kuve out three wide back in behind these Hysteria Lane travels okay then came Karina uh, Bell back in behind these as they come towards the home turn was Cantalara from Sombrui and last of all is Spawn of Elia around the turn they come now 250 metres to go elusive box as a leader final overs coming after then came Beauty Ace out wider now Joe Kuve is looking to run and here comes this Hysteria Lane coming after them quickly. Final over though. It's got the lead. Hysteria Lane's about a length and a half. Sitting out after it. Final over. Uh, Hysteria Lane can't pick it up. Final over will win. Hysteria Lane second. Photos for third between Joe Kuve and the late finishing Som Brui out wide. Close up also as they went across the line was uh, Cantalara, then Beauty Ace, then Elusive Boxes, Spawn of Elia, Karina Bell, and back near the tail of the field was Basu Basu in a pretty competitive race. But number five, final over, and that's the one at $4.10, $1.30. Hysteria Lane got out into the clear and looked as though it was going to make it interesting. But final over found plenty, and it races away. Hysteria Lane got to within about a length of it at the line. Joe Cuve will hold on for third, ahead of Sombrui, who arrived late. Then Cantalara and Elusive Boxes close up as well. Final over will take it out in the fifth on the card. Yeah, cheers, George. Travel to treat in the run. Lovely spot from Vinnie Colgan. Got one by one. Asked the horse to progress around the point of the bend. Had one last charge to hold out. That was Hysteria Lane, but she's done it. She's done it nicely. Backed up the form. Form from the previous race. Point Percy follows up into this race. Final over. A little double hit there for everyone. It'll be five in front of the six. Joe Cuvay might be able to finish into third as well. Just in front of the fast finishing ten in Sombruel. But we'll get it confirmed shortly, and then hopefully we'll have a time to... Have a quick word to Jonathan McRae, the winning trainer. Here's the judge. Tokara 1200, the winner five, final over. Second six, Hysteria Lane. Third seven, Jue Cuve. Fourth ten, Sombrio. Fifth three, Cancellara. And sixth twelve, Elusive Boxes. Call again, five, six, seven, ten, three, twelve. Winner's time 110.20, last 600 off the front and 35.57. Joined by Jonathan McRae, why don't you, Jonathan? Backed up a good trial. You would have got confidence out of the previous race and she's been able to do it for you here first up this prep. Well, second up. Well, actually, Vinny was the one who told me about the previous race. I didn't actually see it. <laughs> so, yeah, it did give me a wee bit of confidence after that, yes. Yeah, and backed up the trial. Trial was really good. She had stacks of uh, gas left in the tank and she travelled up nicely that day. She travelled here good here as well. Yeah, well, Vinny was just told to give her an educational at the trials. We weren't actually here to win, but uh, that was a bonus. And uh, today's a bonus too, right. yeah. Got something in mind for the rest of the prep? Uh, well, we kind of like to take each race as, we, as it comes, really. Right. Um, nothing nothing at this stage. It's a starting point at least. You've got to win in the yeah. bank. Well done, dear Jonathan. Yeah, okay. Thanks very much, Brendan. Okay. Jonathan McRae, the winning trainer of.